Why Amazon is flooded with power banks? All the online marketplace in the world is going through a significant changes in the product categories for the past few years. Take Amazon as an example. Amazon, the largest online marketplace in the world, offers millions of products from around 40 categories to its customers. Though Amazon started with books, but with the passage of time, its collection has become even enriched, eventually turned itself into a giant. In 2019, electronics is the most purchased product category from Amazon, having a 44% sales of total sales volume. Apart from Amazon, this is a common scenario for most of the largest online marketplaces. Electronics itself is a vast category consists of tons of products but today we want to talk about a very specific one which is one of the most contributing products to make this portion going bigger and bigger yes we are talking about power banks currently there are more than 5000 brands delivering power banks through amazon and you'll find uncountable numbers of sellers for them have you ever thought why Amazon and other marketplaces are getting flooded with power banks, which even didn't exist a few years back? Let's dig deep. Hey guys, I'm Chaser and you're watching Tech Square. We are currently living in such a world where everything runs on devices and gadgets like smartphones, tabs, cameras, portable speakers, smartwatches, and so on. And they have added so many conveniences to our life. But they have added problems too. Though everything runs on devices and gadgets, these devices and gadgets run on power. The moment your devices and gadgets run out of power, it'll disconnect you from the whole world. That means you're going to be technologically dead. Due to adding so much functionalities, features, hardware, large display, especially having evolution in mobile network generation technology, these devices, batteries cannot hold power for a long period of time. So running out of power for these devices is a frequent happening. So unless you find an alternative power source, you are not allowed to go live. But that is not always possible to find a charging port when we are on the go. This is where the power bank appears as a solution. The concept of power bank first came into light in 2001, when it was assembled by a student with a few AA batteries and a control circuit. It first appeared in Las Vegas International Consumer Electronics Show in 2001. Power banks had its marketing phase during 2004 to 2006. This was the time when a mobile power bank with the name Engine Compartment was launched by Huachi. When other brands like iGo and Anytone came up in the market, it gave a new strength and energy to power banks industry. But how did demand of power bank become so intense? iPhone is involved here directly. When the iPhone was introduced to the people in 2007, it took the market by a storm. It had everything people wanted in a smartphone, but it didn't have a powerful battery. The built-in battery powered the device for only 4 hours. People couldn't use a spare battery for emergency situations because its battery was non-removable. People needed a solution for their charging problems and all of a sudden, power bank became the lifesaver. After an Android smartphone manufacturers started to build phones with non-removable battery, power bank market skyrocketed. As a result, North America eventually had seen a major growth in mobile power bank market due to the third largest number of smartphone users and high requirement of internet-based services in mobile phones which resulted a supporting market for mobile power banks. Europe also registered healthy growth in the mobile power bank market due to the large number of portable devices connected to the internet. Germany has the largest number of internet users followed by United Kingdom and France. 
The heavy use of GPS and high-speed internet, Wi-Fi variations, larger display, and more powerful processor consume batteries tremendously, resulting in increasing demand of mobile power banks. Asia-Pacific also started dominating the market of mobile power bank market due to the high number of users of smartphones and electronic gadgets in this region such as China and India. China is the most populous country in the world and has the highest number of mobile phone users followed by India. The growing number of mobile phone users and heavy use of internet services in this region contributed to the market of mobile power bank to grow and achieve new heights. At the same time, people's purchase behavior was getting upgraded. People started to become more into online shopping and thus Amazon and other online marketplaces started to add more products categories in the process. So no wonder given by such immense demand, power bank as a product would sneak into these online marketplaces electronic category. Where the demands arise, supplies will be there. To prove this theory right, today over 100 manufacturing companies are making power banks. Giants like Xiaomi, Samsung and others have concentrated manufacturing facilities for power banks. Big accessory companies like Anchor has risen, riding on the success of selling power banks. They are now one of the biggest players in this market. Plus, the production cost to manufacture a power bank is very low at this point, so comparatively limited resource electronic manufacturer can produce power banks too and add more supplies. A bigger portion of this vast supply is going to another giant, Amazon, where currently power bank is one of the 50 most searched items. Power bank is also one of the most purchased products in the online marketplaces like Alibaba, eBay, and so on. That is how the demand has been created of power bank, and as a result, online marketplaces are getting loaded with it. According to AlliedMarketResearch.com, the global power bank market size was valued at 16,338.1 million in 2017 and it is projected to reach about 19,404.2 million by 2025. Registering a CAGR of 2% from 2019 to 2025. So the statistic says using power bank will be one increase in the upcoming years. So will the supply. But recent introduction of fewer gadgets indicates somehow there is a chance for market to get rid of power banks. Though there is no sign of massive innovation in lithium-ion batteries yet, still most of the recent smartphones are coming with more than 4000 mAh batteries. Samsung had introduced reverse wireless charging technology in their S10 and Note 10 smartphone. Now you can charge your earbuds and other gadgets wirelessly through your phone. These new features might save us from carrying a power bank all the time, but that doesn't mean we will no longer need a power bank. For long outdoor staying or traveling, power bank will be still a must-have accessory. Anyway, let's see how this journey goes. I think we will need to wait for a couple of few years to experience the destiny of the power banks. Alright, thank you guys for watching this video. If this video was helpful, make sure to like this video, share and subscribe to TechSquare for more future videos.